I was just told off about these shoes that there's nowhere to wear these and I was like yeah well you could wear them to places but literally I just bought them because they're fairly cheap um, and I needed something that looked a little bit like heels for this online competition that I'm doing so um, but saying that I think they're quite nice I mean I got nothing but negative from whoever I live with but I don't no, I don't generally like these sorts of shoes because there's no ankle support and the the tip of these sho shoes are actually quite small so you can lose your balance in them really easily and even though they only have a little bit of a lift you can lose your balance so I was like I know what these sorts of shoes are like because when I see this sort of thinner heel I'm like I'm going to lose my balance in these, aren't I? <laughs> and that's exactly what I thought when I saw them online, but I only needed them for just, you know, to make it look like I have some sort of heel. Um, I've been entering this competition for the past few months. I really hope that I don't make it to the next round because then it's going to end up being like online video, a little bit embarrassing. You have to probably either get my clues from storage or um, buy new ones so that I can do the videos and I'm like well I hope it doesn't go this far too far too much further because I really am like sort of just stringing things together this year so um, I had to buy myself a dress I had to buy myself these shoes and they don't even come off as fancy or anything on the in, on the um, videos. So even though they're actually quite nice, um, they don't come across as fancy on the video. It just looks like a plain Jane walking around in a dress and shoes. You know, you can't even see like the gold things on the shoes or how nice they are. But saying that, um, I actually think these are really nice shoes. I mean, they've got... I mean, for shoes that have the thinner heel, they're not they're not that bad. I mean, I can walk in them okay. I just need a little bit of practice to keep walking them. I might go to a cinema in these sorts of shoes um, if I lived close to the cinema or was driven. Other than that, you know, I don't. I think I'd have a hell hell of a time walking down the street in these sorts of shoes. I usually go for the chunky heel shoes to walk around um, and look nice. So. Um, these are a little bit impractical in many ways, I guess, to some extent, but they're still nice. They've got like this um, elastic sort of, I wish it was velvet though, I wish it was like a velvet rim, but it was elastic and it has a little gold bit and it's nice and comfortable and I actually didn't lose my balance too badly when I wore them for the making of this little clip that I was doing. So, um... I actually find them quite a nice shoe. Um, I don't know what the brand is. I think it's like Rivers, yeah, Rivers brand. So usually um, they've got a pretty good shoe. And what size is this? 42. Ooh. I bought a 41 boot in the, essence, in the hope that it would fit me. So hopefully I don't need a 42 boot. Either way, it doesn't really matter. I can always sell them on the internet. Um... I was going to sell these shoes on the internet, but I might keep them for a little while just in case. I'm definitely going to keep them like till whenever the competition's over and I don't need heels anymore. Because these are sort of, I never buy heels because heels are expensive. I would only buy a heel if it were really quite cheap. Um, but um, these are my version of heels this year. So last year I had $15 um, chunky heel heel shoes from Big W they were like down from like $40 and they were like 15 and I was like oh my gosh I wanted a shoe just like this but they're a little they're not just tall and chunky but that I really hate their shoes because they don't have a very good sole to walk around in and you just wear them it's like oh these are gonna get like really uncomfortable really quickly but for the purpose it was a nice high shoe made it look like I have a heel and so this year I did the same thing, I bought a, like a $15 shoe, um, down from like $80 or $90, <laughs> and um, just use it as a temporary heel, but I've never actually worn 
bought myself heel sheets because they're not always that cheap um, on specials. So, but either way, I think that's a pretty nice shoe. And so I thought I'd make a video to say for a skinny heel shoe, it's not too bad. I can actually wear them. I might even be able to walk around in them if I have enough practice. And, um, but what I don't like about those shoes is the ankle support because my ankles are a little bit sensitive and I sort of prefer ankle support. So, um, but other than that, it's a pretty good shoe. So that's all I wanted to say. It was a nice shoe, nice looking shoe. It's pretty comfortable. I could even maybe wear it if I practice walking them <laughs> and I'm glad I bought them. I might even keep them. So that's awesome.